What is up YouTube? It is Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time. Back with another video in today's video, should you buy or deny MIDI Morph, the smart melody assistant by Audio Tech Hub, all right? But before we go any further, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you can get any video I upload to the channel. Now, this is an instant melody transformation, basically a MIDI randomizer, all right? MIDI Morph. Also, if you don't, I got it from R Loops, but if you know, you just want to go to the site, here it is, and they got VSTs and other things. All right, so let's go into FL Studio and check out should we buy or deny MIDI Morph. We are in FL Studio. This is how it looks when it opens up. Um, it's not too much to it, it's pretty simple and to the point. Um, so let's check it out. So it has play, stop, variation, tame. I guess I don't you know oh, I guess that's you can move reduce the length of the notes okay the randomize randomize to lower notes go down to octave go up an octave undo redo which is always key because you you hitting buttons so fast you might you might miss something all right export and then clear all right let's go to undo that clear oh you can't undo the clear my bad so let's randomize and oh so when you clear it goes away you got to put in some kind of other midi all right i did not know that my bad y'all my bad y'all let's put drop something in so i'm dropping this in right now let's play how it sounds Okay, so that's not MIDI morph. That's my own MIDI, right? So let's turn up the variation all the way and randomize. Okay, so you remember it was up. These are the up the octaves. Now, what we have it is kind of in there somewhere. And then you can take the whole thing down. Okay, so let's throw in the original again. And then, let's see what we get. Okay, this is where the, the key is, randomizing it crazily. Just going through these cycles. That's where it would be, that's where it would be very effective, like giving you something different. All right, so obviously this, that, doesn't sound like this one. Cause you got the whole riff, which is dope, but then undo, or you can't, they don't let the extra undo. Going through the randomized button until you get something that's just totally different. So that one has a little bit of the old one. but just different, okay? So now you get two and one on your MIDI, but now I wanna delete this. I wanna see what they give you off top. Let's look at what they give you off top, because I accidentally deleted mine off top. So let's look and see what they give you off top. All right, so. I can use that, that's trap all day. Okay, nice. So I want to randomize that. Just enough randomization. Because when I'm using this, 
I want to be able to get five to eight different types of MIDI out of one MIDI, right? I don't want to just have the same thing. So this is pretty much what we started with. And then this is what it changed into. So that sounds like just a little bit different than the other one. Let's keep on randomizing. Take it up an octave. And there you have it now simple that's pretty much to the point but the one thing how do you get it out into a different vst so you can have uh, more sounds to choose from right well that is the drawback right there because when you export it you can only export it and you gotta you gotta save it as a file you can't just drag it over so if they ever do mini morph uh part two hopefully you could just take the export and I'll show you so you got to export it out like instead of just dragging it over and they're not gonna let you drag it so that's the only downfall I can see in this one because I want to be quick access I don't want to have to download save the file and then get it I mean it's not a lot but it's, it's a lot at the same time when you're working when you're in a good workflow so that's the drawback that knocks it down from being just perfect to on the go quick to use yeah, and you just like say drag, drop MIDI. Oh, 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 I never knew that. Okay, my bad, y'all. <laughs> my bad. I wasn't familiar with your game. My fault, y'all. I, 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 when I was doing the research, I didn't know. So in real time, I was reading this. I'll click the drag the MIDI above. Okay, now we got it. Now we got the, the, the points. Do, 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 do. Add the points back up. Dope. Dope, dope, dope. All right, because you can go from this one now we're going to go some variation randomize it change up the whole vibe of it so yeah we're random out look this is what i want you to see when you put up just the upper notes just the bottom notes which are usually the chords these are the top layers so that's what you're basically you know randomizing so if you want to bot like let me take one more so if you just want the chords just to be you know randomized then pretty much the bottom notes So you got your own little custom MIDI uh, randomizer. Um, some good, some bad. Mostly good. Sticks to the core MIDI that you're throwing in there. And then they give you some of their own MIDI that you can use and you can randomize from there. So it's your boy Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time. Hit the like and subscribe button. Join the family today. We're growing, growing, growing. I got some free loop kits for y'all. Just hold on tight, all right? MIDI Morph, buy or deny. Let's go.